Welcome to the testing world. In this session, we are going to cover one more listener, which is assertion result listener. So here we have a test plan inside the test plan thread group and two samplers. Coming to the thread group, right click on that, add listener, which is assertion results listener. This session is going to work only when we have assertions in our thread group so i am going to add few assertions so one assertion that i am going to add is size assertion in the size i am giving like size should be equal to 1000 bytes and apart from it i am going to add one more assertion which is html assertion so i have added two assertions and now clearing the previous result running it so this assertion result listener is going to display results only for the assertions here we can see five users are running on my thread group because we have applied five users over here again coming to the assertion result so once we are getting response from the server it's going to apply assertion and if assertion is getting failed so it's going to display the reason of the failure as well so here it shows size assertion is failed because the result was on the wrong side. HTML assertion is failed just because tidy parser error is three. So we have three errors and few warnings. Here we can see it shows result for each and every sampler for each and every user. And it shows why this assertion is getting failed. So all the details related to the assertions can be viewed in the assertion result listener. This assertion result listener will only be displayed if we have assertion is in our thread group and they are getting failed. I am changing this assertion. I am removing the HTML assertion and only size assertion I am having and running it for only two users clear the result running it again so here it's running for the two users and now see in case of assertions are getting passed so it just display on these steps assertions are applied but because it's getting passed so nothing to display over here so we are getting pass and failure result failure assertion result in this assertion result listener but in case of the pass it's going to display only sampler names but in the case of failure it's going to display complete result thanks for watching this video